Hello everyone and welcome. This is Dawn. I'm so glad you could join me. Today I'm going to be using the Whimsy Stamps Hello Word Die and Shadow. I love the size of this die. It measures approximately four and a quarter inches long by one and a half inches tall when you use the shadow. You really don't need much else when using it as it acts as your focal point on the card. So let's get started. Today I'm going to be playing with my alcohol inks. I haven't taken them out in a while and I thought they would pair up nice with the Hello die. I'm using the Ranger Heavy Duty Yupo paper, but you could easily use the regular Yupo paper if you wanted to. I'm using some silver mixative. I have my blending solution, my air blower, cranberry color, and the amethyst color. I'm going to start out by putting the blending solution all over the paper. I make sure to shake up all of the inks really good, especially the silver mixative. I put a few drops of the amethyst color down on the paper and then I just take my air blower and I just work the amethyst color all around the paper. Then I add a few drops of the cranberry color and I just use my blower again to spread out the alcohol ink. There's no right or wrong way to do this. I just try to have fun with it. Next, I bring in the silver mixative. I do find it dries a little bit quicker than the regular alcohol ink, so I just keep adding more blending solution to it. I keep repeating the process of adding the alcohol inks along with the blending solution until I get the desired look that I want. And if you don't like how it looks, just keep adding the blending solution and you could change the look of it very easily. I love how the background came out, so I decided to make a five by seven card instead of my usual five and a half by four and a quarter inch card. I cut a piece of plum cardstock to six and three quarters by four and three quarters. And then I trim my alcohol ink background down to six and a half by four and a half inches. I'm gonna cut the Hello Shadow die from some white cardstock. I thought that would look great against the colored background. Then I die cut the Hello Word from black cardstock. Using my Misty Stamping Tool, I'm gonna stamp out the flowers from the Sympathy Silhouette stamp set because I want to place it behind my Hello Word. I ink it up really good with some black ink and I press down really good to give it a good impression. And then using the coordinating die, I tape it in place and I run it through my die cut machine. I play around with the layout of my card and realize I want the black Hello letters to be raised up so they stand out a little more. So I die cut two more sets of the Hello Word from black cardstock. I start to assemble my card and I adhere the plum colored cardstock on top of the white card base. And then I adhere the alcohol inked background on top of the plum cardstock. And then I take the three sets of the Hello Word and I stack the letters on top of each other. I'm not gonna show me doing all the letters because the process is the same for all of them. To finish off the Hello Sentiment, I adhere all the black letters onto the white shadow base. I saved the L letter for last as it overlaps on top of the other L. And using some liquid glue, I adhere the flowers where I want them to go on the card front. And then I adhere the Hello Word over the top of the flowers. And to finish off the card, I adhere confetti onto the front of the card using my liquid glue and my jewel picker. And I just love how this card came out. The confetti really adds to the look of the card. And this card is so quick and easy to make and it's lots of fun. And that will complete my card for today. I would love for you to leave a comment below and let me know what you think of the card. And if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos and new product releases. As always, thanks for stopping by and have yourself a wonderful day.